Welcome to this video tutorial for Stock Investor Pro, AII's fundamental stock screening and research database program. In this video segment, we will discuss how to create custom stock screens. Stock screening is the process of applying a set of quantifiable criteria to a universe of stocks to isolate stocks that match those criteria. Users create new stock screens or edit existing stock screens using the screen editor. To get to the screen editor, choose Screen Editor from Tools or click on the Screen Editor icon. Alternatively, you can press Alt and S. I plan on screening for stocks that are not ADRs and have an annualized growth rate in earnings from continuing operations over the last five years of at least 10%. I also want the PE to be less than half of the industry median and 26-week relative price strength to be in the top 90%. I will start by clicking on the first cell under Field and selecting Company Information. There I will select ADR and ADS stock. For Operator, I will select Is False. In the next cell, I will expand the category Growth Rates, which is where continuing earnings over the past five years can be found. In Operator, I will choose Greater Than or Equal To. In Compare To, I will click once to open up the Field Picker menu, and I will click again in order to type. Here I will type 10. In the next Field cell, I will expand Multiples and select PE. For Operator, I will select Less Than or Equal To, and in Factor, I will type in 0.5. Factor actually acts as a multiplier for whatever data point is chosen for the Compare To cell. I will now click on the cell in Compare To, expand Medians, and select Industry. This line of criteria tells the program that I want companies with a PE of less than half of the industry median PE. Next, I'll, I'll click on the fourth cell underneath Field and expand Percent Rank. Here, I will scroll down until I see Percent Rank Relative Strength 26 Week. For Operator, I will select Greater Than or Equal To, and in Compare To, I will type in 90. This last line of criteria tells the program that I'm looking for stocks with a relative price strength over the past 26 weeks to be in the top 90th percentile of the entire stock universe. In other words, I want the top 10% of stocks by relative price strength over the past 26 weeks. Now that I've entered all my criteria, I'm ready to run my screen. Before that, I can press how many and the program will show me the exact number of stocks that pass each line of criteria, as well as the number of stocks that pass all the lines of criteria. In our screen, 31 companies pass all four lines of criteria, as shown by the 31 in the bottom right of the screen editor. Click Apply to load the passing companies into the stock notebook. As you can see, the 31 passing companies are now loaded into our active stock notebook. You can see how many companies are currently active in the stock notebook by looking at the bottom left of the screen. You can also save any custom screen to use in the future. Click on Save As at the bottom of the screen editor and provide a name. You can also add a short description. After you save the screen, the screen will be loaded into the screen drop-down menu at the top of the page. As you can see here, our custom screen is now available to use at any time. One of the most common questions we receive from users is how to find which data category a particular field is in when creating a screen. This information is available in the Help System, which can be found by clicking on Contents and Index from the Help menu. From this window, double-click on Field Definitions and Alphabetical Listing of Data Fields, and you will find the data fields listed in alphabetical order. By scrolling down to PE, I see that the PE is located in the Multiples category. Alternatively, you can use a quick search and type in the data field that you're looking for. Each data field will also come with a short description and also the calculation that Stock Investor Pro uses. As always, the Stock Investor Pro website and Stock Investor Pro Wiki provides further resources. You may also email us at techsupport at AII.com or give us a call.